Hey guys! So today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of this Five Nights at Freddy's Lego set that I got for Christmas. Oh my gosh, my light. Well, there you know. I use a light now, but... So I've got this Five Nights at Freddy's 110 piece set. It is the party room from Five Nights at Freddy's 2. I've got another one where it's like the kids corner. And I had already put that one together, but I thought, you know what, I'll use this one for a video. So I think I'll just do a little time lapse, slash I'll just come in sometimes and say stuff. But other than that, it should be a little time lapse of putting together this Five Nights at Freddy's set. Um, it's by McFarlane, and it's a really cool set. Um, I believe that this should be able to also snap on with my other set. I don't know 100% with that, or it'll just put together like a puzzle. It might not snap together, but I'll see. Okay, back over to the recording station where I'm going to record me unboxing this. Okay, so I've got the box right here. Hold on, let me adjust my camera real quick. Oh. Okay, so I've got the box here. I'm going to pour out the bags now. Oh, well, there went one bag. Let's try out the next bag. Oh, there's another one of little tiny pieces. Here's one. Another one. Another one. And I believe a pamphlet on how to put it together. And some other things. Along with stickers, which will be very helpful. And, and here, I'm going to pull that out real quick. We've got our Funtime Freddy. Or is that normal Freddy? I'm pretty sure it's Funtime Freddy. Yeah, it's Funtime Freddy. <laughs> so now I'm going to do a little time lapse of putting this together. Okay, I actually had to do a little bit off camera because if I was to keep doing it on camera, um, this would be like a 20,000 minute video, but I got this off and I'm going to continue doing the back and the rest of this. I just had to get the flooring done. Oh no, he shot his leg off.
Okay, so I've added balloons and I've made a little table. Um, there's some more instructions on the table that I'll follow. Like it says put this little textured thing over it. And I'm just going to do that. Okay, so I now have my thing right here. It is this. I basically have it pretty much finished. There's some more details to add on. As you can see, there's more pieces that I'm going to continue. Okay, so lighting has changed and everything because my lights are slowly dying, but I had a little bit of confusion with the table. As you can see, I spent a long time on it. I have all these little party hats that are supposed to go on the table. These things, these are supposed to fit on the table, but I was like, okay, because there's little grooves that you can stick them in, but it said put on the sticker. It's an important part, so I was like, okay, whatever, I'll, I'll put it on. So I put it on, and then I realized that there's only two holes uncovered for all these hats to fit on. There was enough holes in the table, but to have the sticker on it, it removed them and covered them. So I was like, okay, well, I'll just put it on the, I put it on the wrong way. I'll put it on the different way. Put it on the different way, and it still didn't work. So I just have all these leftover party hats that I will put in a little baggie. And this little baggie right here, I'm going to put them in the box, that way I don't lose them. But we also have some extra pieces, like a floorboard piece, a wall piece. And this also happened with um, my other Lego set too. And then we have another one of these. And that is pretty much all the leftover pieces. And this is the Five Nights at Freddy's set.